Second and 12. Now Allen. And it's a short one here, complete to his tight end. And able to get this across the 20 before going out of bounds. He's been quiet today in the passing game, just his second catch. Yeah, and people have to come up with schemes to limit him. And, and what a lot of teams do, they'll double him, you know, use a linebacker underneath, a safety over the top. Sometimes they'll just take a corner, maybe their third corner if he's a bigger guy, and put him on a man-to-man -to, -man to try and limit his touches. Just keep mixing it up, give him different angles, different looks, like a good boxer does. And he is going to have the Dolphins first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Play action. Now it's Allen. Evans has it left side. And they've got it well across midfield down to the 30 before it's all said and done. A nice gain of 21 yards. I don't know what they talked about at halftime. Whatever it was, they won the look like a different team here in the third quarter. Yeah, I doubt that they're going to make trash. Kansas got kicked over that type of speech. I think what they did was they analyzed what worked in the first half, what didn't, and figured out a better game plan. A run with Mostert up the middle. It's a six-yard pickup, and it gets him to second and four. Kid had a ton of success here so far, but you get the feeling that he might be on the verge of popping one? Yeah, even on that one, there was a little bit of a hole, but it closed there quickly at the end. Second down, here's Mostert again. A pickup of about three yards as he's taken down at the 31. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. It's third and one. They'll try and run here with Mostert. And a strong run there as he'll maneuver his way down inside the 15. 59 yards now on the ground on just seven carries. I hope we give enough respect to the big guys up front because they have been getting it done on this drive. The holes have been large, and they've been barreling through them, picking up first downs. Throwing now is Allen. That is caught. And the Dolphins are going to be set up with a first and goal on a pass play that moves them all the way down to the one. Might we see our first touchdown of the game? Here's first and goal. the middle they go with Mostert and he is in touchdown Miami Raheem Mostert taking it in from a yard out and the Dolphins go coast to coast and finish the drive off with six points well he'd been the workhorse on this drive and it would have been unfair to bring someone else in to finish the job so they go back to him again and he delivers with a touchdown run Full connects on the extra point, and they take the lead here at 7 to 6. That one in the books as a 12 play drive, and it was capped off by a touchdown run from Raheem Mostert. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26 yard line. The Cardinals offense now ready to get their first opportunity here in the second half. And Charles, it feels like we're set up for a good second half here. Came out of the locker room, one score game. Now the lead has already changed hands. Well, this offense, they've got an opportunity right now to take that lead right back. Yeah, and it feels like you're going back and forth almost a little bit like a tennis match, right? And we're just, you know, our heads just keep moving. Which side has it? Which side's going to score? How are they going to go out doing it? A little bit of a challenge for each side trying to match each other. Right back to Njoku. Seven yards there and a first down. Harris running straight ahead. And he tries to power forward, but he will not get back to the line of scrimmage. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. And they're not going to get to the line to run another play. So we will switch ends as the third quarter has come to a close. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports.
back now in Miami. This one's still anybody's ball game. It's a one-point difference here as we begin the fourth quarter of play. Second and 11 now. delay here's Harris and he'll get about two there to the 36. Oftentimes we praise an offense for their variety of being able to hit people with the run in the pass but in this game how about what we're seeing from the safeties they are all over the field doesn't matter if they threw it or if they're trying to run it. I don't think we've ever awarded an MVU most valuable unit but you're right it might go to them in this game. I like that MVU well done. Richardson Pass taken in by his big tight end. Look at the big fella go. Touchdown, Cardinals. David Njoku, 64 yards. And the Cardinals answer back with a touchdown of their own to take a fourth quarter lead. And he's got it. So the two-point conversion is good, and they add on to their fourth-quarter lead. And around the goal line, especially on two-point tries, sometimes the QB's best friend is that big target, the tight end. I love how you described it, because you know he's going to have some length and some catch radius, as well as a big body to keep people away from the football. And they're going to have good starting field position. He's out of bounds, but not before he's across the 35. Josh Allen in the offense now. Down 14 to 7. A little under two and a half to go. Plenty of time here. They've got three timeouts and the two-minute warning as they've got it first and ten. So the Dolphins have it as we welcome you back in. They come up on a first and ten, desperately needing a score here on what could be their final drive. Now Allen. And his throw is going to be incomplete. He was unable to complete it there, and just not the game that you would expect from him. He's been off the mark, really, start to finish. Yeah, it makes you wonder what exactly is going on. Is he a little bit dinged up here? Or is he just off just by a bit? Maybe he can get it back in this situation. He'll need to. Touchdown! Donald Poole, a 22-yard touchdown round. And the Dolphins are an extra point away from tying this game here in the final minutes. Well, the hard part's done. Now they just need to split the post, tie it up, but then their defense is going to have to hold up to send it to overtime. Yeah, no matter what. I know there's an inclination in it when you have momentum to go for two here. But if you miss it, you don't give your defense a chance at all. Plus, it's been a good game. I want to see overtime. I'm selfish. <laughs> you obviously don't have a flight to catch. Tomorrow. Now Allen. And it is caught. They got the two points, and with it, they've taken the lead. Well, they had guts to go for that, and they got it. Now, if you're the defense, you feel some major pressure, don't you? Well, they put it on you, haven't they? They've told you that you are the unit they believe in. We'll find out now if they can make it hold up. But, boy, just going for it in that spot. I know, right? Amazing. And it's a pretty good return here as he'll get this up to the 29. Now it's the Cardinals' turn. Trailing by one after the two-point conversion. A minute 47 on the clock. And they need about 35 yards to get in range for a winner as they come up on first down. Richardson to throw it. Pass complete to Harris. And he's going to lose yardage and be backed up to the 25. Not in a position where they absolutely have to rush right now, but they definitely have to pick up the tempo a bit. Come up now on second down. Here's Richardson. Oh, and that nearly ended him. That should have been intercepted, but he cannot corral it, and that is a lifeline there with third down coming up. Nearly an interception. 
interception. If that one's picked off, it's over. So a new lease on life, so to speak. A lot of times when you're in coverage, you're so focused on the man and the coverage that sometimes the ball, if it arrives, it surprises you. That may have happened to him in that situation. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. It'll be a loss of eight on the sack, and it's going to lead him to fourth down. We've watched this a long time, and I still don't believe we get it. They're in long. Why are you calling that action? Because yeah, they're not going to bite defensively, right? No, not at all. I did have a coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to deal with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they're silly, and it leads to a play-action sack. Here we go. This is fourth down. Fourth down, desperation time. Here's Richardson. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. They had to go for it with such little time remaining, and it's looking like the Dolphins are going to win the football game. So from the 17 now, here's a first and 10. They hand it off to Mostert. And he's across for the touchdown. And in the final minute, that should just about seal it. And that touchdown puts him up seven. But now's when the fun begins, partner, because if you go ahead and kick the extra point, it's still a one-possession game. Go for two, you might put it out of reach. Yeah, a little decision to be made. On for the extra point is four. And with that, the lead is up to eight. A nice, tidy little drive there, getting the ball in excellent field position and only one play to score it. Morstead out now following the touchdown to kick. And a decent return out to the 27-yard line. Arizona getting ready to go as they take the field. Well, Charles, you remember their last drive. They went for it on fourth down, didn't get it. But you understand why they did in this close game late. Now, though, the road back is even tougher. Yeah, no doubt about it. It was fair to look back and say the fourth down was the moment where this one was decided. But as you mentioned, understandable about why they went for it. But, hey, a lot of credit to the guys on the defensive side of the ball. They knew they'd have to defend in that situation, and they got it done. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Now Richardson. Completes to the Joker. Out across the 40-yard line before he's brought down. So a first down and then some. And now we won't see a play on first down. We're going to get a timeout instead. As it'll come with 15 seconds to play in the ball game. Two timeouts still in their back pocket. It's first and ten. Richardson. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Harris. Now they burn the timeout. And they're kind of in that gray area where they might be able to get two plays in, but maybe just one play left in this ball game. We'll see. will be incomplete one second left to go not only did he have a chance to scan the field there it felt like he had a chance to scan it twice the protection was that good unfortunately for him the coverage downfield equally good now a desperation throw deep downfield and it's incomplete so they're five 